This is Football Analysis and I'm here with Gunners, Gunners, Go Gunners. Is that your sound or what? Come on you Gunners. Who they, who they, Papa Zuzu, who they, Zuzu, you don't whine. Now my name be Das now. Win, <laughs> win, and win. All right, all right, all right. So you won today. So how was the match? Oh, actually, the performance today was not that, uh, was not that good for me. But at last we won. Winning is the, is the, is the outcome. Not uh, not working and working and working and your work done will be equal to zero. We need to win. Yes, and we've just shown them that yes, we are the title contenders. Brentford really, really tried today. They nearly tarnished Arsenal image this this season. What can you say about that? Oh, they wanted to. <laughs> I don't even know. They frustrated us. They did. They tried to block all our tactics. All the tactical approach that we we try to introduce they were just trying to like block it and bl even is it's a very very long time i would say it's a very very long time you see us now scored that kind of goals like cross and and not uh it's very it has, it has been a very long time when us now did something like that as now just they they're always playing with their legs play short and um, take it taka you know but today after trying all our possibly using saka's wing trying to use the other wing the outcome was zero. Then we improvise. Okay, what's the next thing? Let's try this. And I think it worked out for our first goal. Alright, coming to Ramsdale's error. What do you have to say about that? Ramsdale, you can actually, you can see that he has been on the bench for a very long time. Though, yes, he has been training, but he is going to be affected. No matter what. Because someone that has been on bench coming to this kind of game, Brentford is they are always they are they are one of the opponents that give us a very 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 difficult like they are always they are always frustrating us anytime we play them either we play one 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 zero the goal difference between Arsenal and Brentford is not is always very very close so I'm just happy that we want today even with this error we should have that, that error should have been avoided just give now yeah, Saliba has already depth for him okay give him the pass. As me has the confidence, the hundred percent confidence, you have no more to do there. You can actually cut the ball or just give uh, Saliba. But unfortunately, it led to you go for Brentford. So what is the talk? You say Mikel Atieta used bench one kill that's at there today, and he lost his confidence and everything. His composure, everything is gone today. Actually, um, Ramsey does not have that hundred percent confidence. Yes, we know. He has been doing some mistakes earlier before we signed the uh, um, Raya. He has been doing some silly mistakes. So, which um, Raya? Raya is a very. He has this confidence. He can play from the back. He can like serve ball very well. He can locate player easily compared to Ramsey. But I think it's the um, um, it's the bench that uh, Ramsey have been. Though he tried today. Without two saves from uh, from Ramsey, oh, he tried, he tried, he tried, but then that mistake should have been avoided. So, what's your pattern of play today? My pattern of play today, I tried all my tactical approach. <laughs> I tried the midfield. Even Giorgio tried some, you know, those up to passes, but it didn't work out. So, I think the pattern of play today was just trying to use the we trying to use the wing cross and not and i think it worked out there are some shots that was blocked as well but we did create there were more chances were not created today so we, but we just you know i said we improvise so when something is not going this way you try to try another way so what what, what are the factors that you know uh, that contributed to the to arsenal team not creating enough chances today if you look at the previous matches, you guys, you know, used to score six, five, and four. Actually, you can see that the opponents that is coming, they are very, they are, they are very difficult for us. They are always difficult for us, and you can see their midfield. They they put like five five midfielders, two attackers. They block. They they, are, they try to block the midfield. They don't want us to play from the midfield at all. And if we don't play for the midfield, from the midfield, it's going to affect us because when Odega is playing, um, um, Declan Rice also is playing. We're always we're always coming out with good results. But if 
those people are not played it's going to affect us and it really it affected us today because our performance was not good what was not that good i was expecting more but unfortunately things went the other way around but i'm good i'm good i'm good Gabriel yeah, Jesus coming out from the bench today and I don't know what happened. He added he, he, he tried his best. I won't say he didn't try, he tried his best within the fifth, uh, last ten minutes. What do you have to say about it? Gabriel yeah, Jesus is this guy that has this fighting spirit. Either we are losing or winning. He's always trying to, you know, he can use the ball, he can dribble, he can he has that ability to to hold, to help the ball with him. Like he wins foul for us. You can see that when he entered within that minute, like two fouls or three fouls, that was one. So I like the Gabriel Jesus, but I just Gabriel Jesus is just a striker that does not score, but he has this fighting spirit. Yes, we are going to do this, we are going to do that. He likes to work with his teammate. Yes, that's all I can say about um Gabriel Jesus today. Havas is it that is that kind of player that when you think he's not turning up, he just turn up unexpectedly you would just see it turning up so what do you what can you say about his own you know form scoring goes in and out within the last four or five matches now that's the beauty of a player you must always turn up yes you must always turn up if your team is is lacking from something i remember there was one match like that i uh, forgot who we played with i think uh, Abbas came from the bench and scored the winning goal for us i think it was one oh he scored the winning goal for us. So that's just that's your expectation for every player that is coming to the pitch or that is on the pitch. Score goals, deliver for your team, let them win, secure the points, and you're good to go. His performance today was good, yes, and that was a very sensational header for me, for him. Do you understand? So, and I love the assist from uh, I love the cross from uh, Ben White. Ben White did a great job today when uh, on the normal pattern that we use didn't work then we try to put the ball in the head though Brentford players are very very tall they can't <coughs> oppose whatsoever ball that is being crossed into their box hitting but nevertheless the the one that we used to score was a very very great one and i love the fact that it was Avat that scored that goal so seeing uh seeing zikchenko being introduced into the team and uh, atleta removed kiwo i don't know what he was trying to achieve then though i know you guys won't go wants to score but did that theater not think about the defense and defend it before bringing on uh Zichenko? i actually did not like that substitution i don't know the reason why you have to bring um Zichenko in but i think um i think he was tired but nevertheless he is this strong man bringing Zichenko, we don't really need Zichenko in that match but the deed has been done, so there's nothing that can be done about that. So, I don't think the substitution bringing in Zichelko was necessary. It is not necessary at all. So, but we can't do anything about that again. That has been done, but their substitution was was not something you is supposed to have done. All right. So, who do you think is your man of the match today? I'll give it to Ramsdale. Yes, with that nice two saves. If not for that save, oh. Oh, he made an error. Yes, he has covered up the the saves with the error because that error it should have been avoided. It was it should have been avoidable. But what are we going to do? But he tried. He tried. That save was a very 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 nice save for him. A very nice very nice save. Imagine that kind of ball coming from. Um, Tony swiped the ball. The ball moves in a C in a C movement. But and he's out of the post. Uh, yes. So to to save that kind of ball, not all keeper can do that. But my Ramsey can do it. Yes. The prefer nearly yes. he had your dream of oh. you know going, you know, clinching Premier League. They they frustrated me today. They they want to turn our stance to to someone that cannot play. Whereas people people are already praising us that yes, they are doing great, they are doing great. But Brentford want to spoil all what I've been trying to bring together just to you know and now i'm in the first position all i need tomorrow for man city and liverpool is draw i will draw draw i won't draw so everything goes like that and my next match i'll try as much as possible to win the Premier league yes your next match should be what i don't know who i'm playing but i think 
and I'm going to win it. Okay, it doesn't matter who you play. What you know is that you will win. Yes, because win is my is my uh, what did I say? The, yes, and that's my motivation now. I must win. All right. So, Arsenal players making you proud now. If you see them now, what message will you pass to them? They should keep the consistency and the commitment. Should they should continue with that? They should just continue with the consistency and the commitment because they know where they are going. But you just have to fight some battles. You understand now? It is not easy. The competition is there. Yes, we have top teams there too. We have the likes of Liverpool and Man City. We are competing. The gap is very, very close. You just have to buckle up and keep moving. Moving with that momentum. You understand? Thank you. All right. Thank you so much for your time. Please, if you are watching, please don't forget to follow us on all social media platforms at Football Analysis and also subscribe to our YouTube channel at Football Analysis. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you on the next one.